hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i will give you a tutorial regarding how to create a 3d text effect in adobe photoshop so let's begin the tutorial so guys let's begin the tutorial by opening a new file and this is in a landscape mode resolution I'm keeping it 300 and color mode I'm taking it RGB now I can press the button ctrl 0 to bring the layout to fit to screen the next step I will be writing a text so black color is okay for me I will write the word D I F U S H A then I can press the button ctrl T to perform the free transformations I'll press the button shift and then drag it so that it increase equally now this seems okay the next step is to rasterize this text layer so I will right click it and select the rasterize type the next step is to modify the font by using the brush tool so I will select the brush tool and color I will be selecting black same as the text and brush I will be selecting the hard brush so I will press the shift button and then draw it if I draw it I will get a straight line I click on this D first and then press the button shift and then just draw it I will get a straight line I will click first and then press the shift button and then just drag it down I'm getting a straight line same as you I'll click first press the shift button and then drag it click press shift button and then drag it down S first click it press the shift button and drag it down then on this is last step click press shift and then drag it down to get a straight line the next step is to apply some gradient color to this so I will select by pressing control and then click on this layer so all my text are being selected and I can go to the gradient tool and select some darker colors okay. and I will go for some bright orange then I can perform the linear okay. I will press the button ctrl D to deselect it now I need to convert this text into 3D so I will right click it and select this new 3d extrusion from selected layer okay we started to get this 3d effect now out here i need to select this extrusion part so this is the extrusion part so i will select this and then i will click on this icon and if i click this icon this properties comes up and diffuse i can change the color I will be selecting some dark green color I can play around with the sign the reflections so this is ok now I will be selecting the background I will right click it and select on poster card then I am getting this type of diffuse effect out here in the background the next step is to merge this text layer and the background so I will do it simply by pressing the button ctrl E now I am having a merge layer between the text and the background so the next step is to render this file so we will go to 3d and click on render the shortcut key is alt shift ctrl R since the rendering process will take a lot of time I will just fast forward it now 
now the rendering process has been completed and we'll right click this background layer select on this rasterize 3d after rasterizing that layer we'll be selecting the text so i will use the magic wand tool to select the text i will keep pressing the button shift while clicking i can add on the selections selection is completed then I will take a new layer I will select this background press the button ctrl C and then paste on it here I need to press ctrl plus shift plus V and if I press only ctrl V it will place the text anywhere in the layout but I want my text to be placed exactly where I have copied it so I have pressed ctrl shift V now I will select this background layer, go to this adjustment layer and select the hue saturations and I can play a bit of the color, the shadow color I am talking about. this seems okay for me uh, hue is plus 40 saturation is 70 lightness I am putting it 7 now the last task we need to do is import some images to put in the text so I will open an image I will just left click and drag it this layer now I can press the button ctrl T to resize the image and press the button enter then I will perform the clipping mask I will bring the mouse cursor exactly in between the layer 1 and layer 2 and press the button alt so this is the 3d text effect we got and I can play around with the levels so guys this is the final output of the 3d text we have created in Adobe Photoshop hey guys thank you for watching my channel i hope you like the tutorials i'm providing to you please like it share it and subscribe it and put some comments below if you have any requests for tutorials you can put it down in the comment sections and i will come up in the next video thank you guys